Hey guys! We're Ruger Robin Pimsy, and welcome back to Elden Ring. And also. And there's a cat Kenai, in the background. Who somewhere. I think wants to sit on me, so he's. Maybe. Uh, Not maybe, he definitely. So, last time we went on an assassin mission. Uh, we cleared out uh, Raya the Scout, who is now Zorias the Scout, secret lair. You know, things crawling in the walls. Like I said, we killed a few people, we invaded their worlds, we did Patch's dirty work for him. We found a ghost that wants us to find a special sword to kill the boss. Uh, yes, to kill Praetor Rykard, who I think appear only only at night. Uh, we found Dialos, who has now moved to here, and he is now the potentate. So, that might be the end of anything to do with Dialos. So, it's a simple life. We'll see. Um, but yeah, we've got another... Uh, request here, but we can't get there from the Divine Bridge. No, well, we, if I and recall, well. if I recall, we were trying to get to, um, we were either going to do Volcano Manor or we were going to go down to that road and follow it up. Yes, so I cleared this out a while back, I uh, said about <laughs> there's a Divine, there's a, a Knight's Cavalry here, so we'll come at night time. So I figured what we'd do is we'd clear out North Leonia. So I was just going to ask, did you go um, in North Leonia? Did you go up the valley? From... You mean this way? No, no, no. This valley yeah. here. Yeah, yeah, we did this before. Okay. Like we, we went like halfway down up to r the Ravine Veiled Village, and then we went and did it again. I don't recall doing so. that water patch at the top. This one? Yeah. This is where <clears throat> Hoarfrost Stomp was. There was a scarab that was invisible running but there's, around. There looks like there's something in that corner, so I was just wondering. Which corner? That, the only corner. That there corner. Go, yeah. No, that's just the edge of Carrier Manor. Oh, fair enough, fair enough. So yeah, we're here at Rani's Rise. We're going to go along this way to North Leonia because there's a site of Grace here, Evergal here. This is where I think Resurrection Painting is, and then we can go and do it from Bellum Highway up to there. Well, because we then, can jump across over there. Uh, maybe, yeah. No, and then we can do Volcano Manor. Okay. That, so. If we have time, that's quite a lot. Uh, it depends on how quickly we get through it. Like, it might not actually take us that long. Um, Question. Before we do yes. that, could you open up your map? Mm -hmm. And could you please put markers on the obelisk? Uh, the markers <clears> on the obelisk <throat> will come later, because they'll clear up for this one and this one, and then we'll get to the obelisk later on. Okay. Um, so yeah, apologies for not being able to stream earlier on this week. Uh, I had a, a work event. Rob is drunk. It's, it's a bit of a weird thing because, you know, I've worked for this company for a little while now. From but this home, is though. But this is the first time I've actually been to meet up with them in person no, and that's stuff not true. like you that. You have met them before, you just Not haven't... all the people that I met on uh, Wednesday. No, but they were from different offices. Yeah, exactly. And it's just one of those things, like, things are now getting back to what people would consider to be normal pre-pandemic. Um, so that's why I didn't get to stream on Wednesday. But it's also why we're streaming a little bit earlier today. Um, and I know there are people that are curious to see what Volcano Manor is like, but we're going to just tie off a few loose ends. It's also why I have a coffee, because I was not expecting to be here yeah. at this time. Oh, I've got another kitty cat in the background that probably wants some attention or two. I uh, did hear that, yes. But I think it was just this guy. Kill him and then we'll have a look around. Kill him and then we'll have a look around. Okay. You did hear that, right? I heard poi kind of thing. I heard a ooh. You heard a ooh. Who does it? Is that a green spider? Yes, that's what I've got a marker on. Oh, okay. <laughs> so Wait. this guy did do anything? The other one? He's Wait. in the um, Nightmare oh, Nest, no. so he'll, he'll die. Oh no, he won't. It's, it's run out. Right, so. let's just. No, 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 hang on. Before you do, look around here because I did hear something. Right, but again, there were no subtitles on the screen, so it wasn't actual dialogue subtitles from an NPC. Subtitles for who? Well, sometimes they do that for NPCs, and I don't think there's anything around here. Or at least there wasn't when I last, like, had a quick check through. Right. Again, I didn't... Because I heard it, so I was like... I didn't really explore this area properly, but I know there are a few things. So, oh, are you okay? Is this more room you have to is one. So this mark will disappear now. Get a sight of grace. And we might be able to talk to Melina or Rani or whoever, but I don't think so. I can't be able to speak now. Yeah. Nope, nothing new. Uh, oh, also last time we picked up the Perfumer Carmen ashes, Depraved Perfumer Carmen. We didn't actually read it. Oh. So, depraved perfumers <laughs> practice their art for themselves alone. Carmen was a notably formidable perfumer whose strength rivaled that of heroes. And it said that he was in search of a secret physic of revivification. Revivification? I've never heard or of that. Or revivification. 
So um, it seems like Trisha is a buffer and Carmen is an attacker. So. Uh, uh, we should probably check in on Bok or something. Uh, I think in. he's still where he is. Could be. Yeah, he's still there. Well, we'll, we'll go ahead in that way anyway to get the Knight's Cavalry. So I'm very, very protective of a Bok. Yeah. Um, but I don't think anything Maybe untoward no is going to happen to him just yet. There's no so room. We take this off Can now. they see him? Uh, they can just about see him on the, the periphery of my camera. So if he decides to move on, then uh, <coughs> people won't be able to see him. Uh -oh. He is a little rotter indeed. He wants to be on me, but I've already got a cat. Well, there's enough room for two, isn't there? There is not. No? Okay. So... Oh. Ah. So this is where the painting was. Huh. Juvenile scholar cap, robe, and a larval tear. Mm. Okay, that's pretty decent rewards. I bet you that'll be good for um, your Magic. build as well, yeah. Maybe. We'll there's see. enemies around here. I know. So a cap worn by younger cavalry scholars, the juveniles birthed anew by the Amber Egg of Queen Renala, the head of Raya Lucaria at Academy. Yet their rebirth is not without imperfections, and thus they do repeat the process, eventually becoming utterly dependent upon it. Rebirth is as sleep to them, and with each awakening, memory fades into oblivion. And yes, this Albanoric is attacking me. I know. I thought it would take longer for the next world to come in. Help. No? One more beam attacking... Oh. Ooh, Ooh, Albanoric Ashes! Okay. So again, let's have a look. The robe. So, same thing. Mm, doesn't seem to do much. It it's gives crap. high vitality and robustness. Let's look at those ashes, though. Yes. Yeah. Uh, ashes. The ashes. Albanoric. Summons two Albanorics, a strapping duo of cartwheeling spirits who wield ripple swords and spew freezing breath. Both are second generation Albanorics with dumpy heads that resemble those of frogs. Right, so those are second generation, so the first generation must be the ones that look like Albus? Uh, maybe. But the I, the concept of a second generation Albanoric doesn't really make sense because... It does make sense because um, Nephili Lou is an Albanoric. No. Nephili not? isn't, no. Um, she was an adopted, um, adoptive daughter of Gideon, but she is an actual tarnished, I believe. Oh, I thought she was. An, why is she? Why was she um, trying to save the Albanorix? Never mind. Anyway, I thought she was an Albanorix, so I thought she would be like third generation or something. Be like, I'm we get pretty sure she's more not. More maybe she is. I'm, I'm, maybe I'm mistaken. But I'm I thought sure. maybe they got oh, more. Oh yeah. More also, human. there's this red wolf of Radigan <clears> around here. Yeah. So. Are you going to go down there? Uh, I don't think there's anything else. I've put a marker on for the resurrection painting, we but that might there. be it. Uh, yeah, we can have a look in a minute, but I was going to go and get this ah. here. An Evergal! Which is an Evergal! Royal Grave Evergal. Okay, so let's enter the Evergal. Who is it? I have no Who's idea. Who's it going to be? Okay, so Night Maiden's Mist on. And then, okay. And then just going. And then trigger the fight. Oh, Onyx Lord. Oh, it's one of the Meteor guys. Gravity magic. I guess so. Yeah, it, it, normally in a crater thing. This looks like the around. ancient hero of Zamor in some way. Oh, it looks like one of the creepy. Maybe the ancient hero of Zamor is an Alabaster Lord. Maybe. Oh, maybe he'll get some cool Meteor stuff. One could hope. Mm. Or maybe that cool meteor blade. Is that, no, I think it's got I have the Falling Star Beast Jaw, which is not the same. Oh, no, that's a big blade, that. It's like yeah. a curved sword. It's not a sword, actually. Yeah. I don't know, it's fucking sick. Mm -hmm. I hope he gives you a good shot. Me too. Oh, oh unfortunately. Careful. So, Meteor's coming? Yeah. Seems like they spray lava on the floor or something like that. Nope. Oh, whoa! Sweet. Yeah, that was really good. Yeah. One more of them and One that'll be it. One more of these. No, uh, I was wondering whether he'd walk into it. Ah, oh, uh, yeah. the life of living with a Bengal cat. Okay, down. 
Okay, so that's the unexplored defeated. Meteorite. Ah, oh, was the spell. I was yeah. hoping for the weapon. The spell's pretty cool, though. Oh, yeah. Ouch! Depends on how good no, it is. No, 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 no. Ouch, 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 ouch. Oh, it could man. be a worse rock sling, God. unfortunately, so... Why Why does he not retract his claws? He doesn't retract his claws, but Coda does. It makes no sense. They were raised exactly the fucking same. I don't know. It's a personality thing. Like, he doesn't go into the cat scratching post as much. He's so. a porcupine. He is. Very, very scratchy. Alright, well that was Onyx Lord defeated. Oh, did there's room now since Spiky Boy just dug into me and kicked him off. Mm -hmm. Come on. Wanna sit with me? Alright, so, oh. meteorites. Nah, no cat. One of the glintstone sources that manipulates gravitational forces summons a void that emits a small rain of uh, a rain of small meteorites, hold to continue the effect. The sorcery originates from the Onyx Lords, who had skin of stone and were called lords in reverential fear of their destructive power. Takes 30 FP and 30 intelligence, so it should well, be we decent. We haven't spoken to Selen for a while either. I don't no, know no, anything to I do. think Selen thing is it's over. Done. Like, she is a graven witch now, and that's kind of all she is ever going to be. Um, maybe she can still teach us stuff if we find it, but... I said cry for your graven witcher. Oh yeah, I am actually wearing the me. talisman as well because it raises potency of sorceries. Oh, you're going to end up graven witch. No, no. Uh, you only do that... Well... Coda, it, get down. It's the same get thing down. as being a dragon communion enthusiast. Is it Technically, in lore, yes, I would become a graven witch. You know, a ball of faces kind of thing. But for the purposes of gameplay, that's not going to happen. Uh... So yeah, so I didn't see if there was anything no, around this way. No, that's the only problem with playing at this time of day. Yeah. Is the, ref the reflection on the telly. Yeah. Arterially. Mm. Well, it's not too bad. I think it's more the lighting this in the is game. This cool as fuck. Look at this. Oh yeah, that. Like, we're going to be heading over that way. The knight's cavalry. Hmm? The knight's cavalry. Where? The statues. Uh, yeah. no, I think those are tree sentinels. Yeah, because of the because of the, like the, yeah, the, yeah. the helmet and so on. I was looking at the horses to be honest. The, the, the horses are in shrouds and stuff like that. So yeah. yeah. So I think we have to go to that from down. Oh, we're, we're, we're going to warp over. But uh, what were you referring to? You said there's a right. Yes, I can do. But I'm sure, it's a safe drop. So yeah, there's the well, Red Wolf of Radagon that we saw. Drop. This one. No, uh, over there. With where, the, where, where the wolf is. Yeah. Where, where the spiky dog is. I don't think so. Seem like it. So there's like a bit to go down there. You mean you in see? terms of the ravine? Uh, yeah, down. Wait, if we be, you've been down there. We've been you? down the yeah. ravine. So we need to go across over there. Yeah. So that's wait, where the tombstones that where are. The death place was. Death place. Yeah, where. Where there was not like savage, you know, like where you go crazy, frenzy. Is that where the frenzy? I have no also, idea what. Also, I've just seen about. something. So if you look over, uh huh. There, there's a bit to drop there. Is that special? It doesn't look special to me. I don't think there's anything uh, crazy there. All right. So it's currently night time. So if we do warp over, like, I can take that off. Uh, I can't see what the marker is because it's out in the way, so <laughs> he will have to get swiftly removed, but I'll move over here. Uh, and yeah, because it's night time, the Knight's Cavalry should be around. I think that's the other main thing with playing a little bit earlier is cats are still <laughs> awake, so cats want to tend. Yeah, but so. I can provide it, it's just, you know. Yeah. So no, it's this one that's really the real problem. The other off. one just bugs off. So mm. you said you wanted to talk to Bok? I just want to check up on him. Uh, yeah, He's fine. Okay. Oh yeah, we haven't actually seen this, but you can alter the eccentrics hood so it oh, takes the hood mean. off. Oh, that's mean! Do that! Uh, I actually kind of like the hood, but... Yeah, but you can see the full face though. Yeah, well, it's still a mask, so... I don't think there's anything else interesting <clears> in terms of... But, yeah. Oh. Oh. So, so that's that. Oh, we were um, going to go up there, weren't we? Yes, we were going to follow the road up. Um, I did explore it a little bit, and um, I got road. a great hammer from a chest here. Follow so, the broken brick road. 
that's all we need to worry about there, I believe. But yeah, there's the Knight Cavalry just above my head now. You're gonna try and kill it? Oh yeah, I'm gonna try and kill it. On foot? Oh yeah, because I can, I can shield, I can use my weapon skills. Like, fighting stuff on horseback, depends. depending on the way you're fighting, is uh, not great. But it's cool. I don't care if it's cool. I prefer I... having the ability to shield and do this. I'm missing well, That was because he got stuck behind the pillar. Yeah, Maybe. But the intention is, is for me to wait for him to get closer and then do it like this. Woo! Yeah, that's pretty good. Mm -hmm. No, no stamina. Oh. We've got an imaginary idiot here. Oh, no, not imaginary idiot. Bok. Uh, Big Harry. Hello. <laughs> they said Bok. I did say Bok. They said, okay. hell yeah, Bok. Thanks for joining, imaginary idiot. How are <laughs> you doing? We've got Bok here. Oh, hi, Bok. Hi, Big Harry. How are you? I have a cat right here, but he's refusing to get on me. He's yeah. sitting at my knee. I think he wants to go and see what his brother's doing, but he also wants to come onto my lap, but he also wants to stay. Yeah. Out here, aren't you? Ooh. He has this, like, um... Would you call it a yak? Yak. Yes. You mean the footstool? Yeah. He has a yak. Yes, it is a yak. On. Yes, it is a yak. Oh, I don't know. Football. It could also be a horned brown cow, yes. Come on, do a swing, because I can't attack you safely if you don't do a swing. Swing, yeah. Okay. Yeah. What the? Oh, yeah. Oh, you got the horse. Yep. Oh, again, again, yeah. There yeah. we go. Ooh, that was really well done, Bob. Uh, I'm assuming this is like 5,000 runes? Yeah, 5,100. Ooh, it's Knight like Rider War, Glaive. Ash of War Giant Hunt. Did you see it? I don't think we've had that one before. No. So, grants quality affinity. Skill developed for confronting gigantic foes. Step low forward from a low stance, carrying the momentum into a sudden upward thrust. Usable in large and colossal weapons are capable of thrusting spears and twin blades. Uh, we also got Knight mm. Rider Glaive. This. Uh, uh, jet Black Glaive with a whip blade as weighty as a bludgeon. Weapon of the Knight's Cavalry who ride funeral steeds. Glaive excels at weighty slash attacks that crash into foes, making it a powerful weapon even on horseback. This 26 strength. strength. Like yeah. Not for us, I don't think. Uh, oh, good boy, my angel. So, yeah, so that's that done. Um, I'm just going to sprint through the rest of this and take this off because I've told you about the Great Hammer. Look. What's over there? What's over there? This. Nothing out of the ordinary. Have you There's... tried to kill that one that's just standing? Yes, I've killed him and he's got nothing new. Okay. Like, he doesn't transform because he, he tries to attack you as I'm soon as you get I'm very hyper close. aware of... The yeah, struggle. exactly. Why well, left? Why well, left? Yeah, it's the Bellum Church. Okay, you've already been there, have you? Well, yeah, because that's where we saw Hayeta. Right. So. so we're going to try and skirt the edge of this a little bit. Hayata. So that avoid Link's getting hit by lover. the siege engines. What was that about Hayeta? Link's lost lover. Uh, why? Hayeta! <laughs> oh, right, okay. I was, gonna, I was thinking, she's like, she's not got anything to do with pots, so it must be something else. <laughs> I thought it was funny. Uh, so you can go down there. Ooh, there was a cake on the wall. Did you see it? There was a scarab on the wall, yes. It's a health scarab. Oh, right. But yeah, like You've I said, already done Discovery. You told me off for doing it. Well, it was because this is just a very large area where there's not actually that much. You're a wrong one. Hmm? You're a wrong one. I don't think I'm a wrong one. But anyway, yeah. So there's nothing else to the right, is there not? That goes towards the big Frenzy Flame Tower, which we already did. Uh, yeah. Right, so I am in kind of the right area yes. then. Yes. Okay. I, I'm really bad with direction for the name and memory. Yeah. In uh, Big Harry says, I think the only enemy that transforms and gives a larval tear in Leonia is the giant lobster. Yes, the giant crayfish thing. Um, I did go back and do that as well, so I've got another one. So we can rest. But are we? We're, well, at, uh, we're at the Grand Lift of Dectus. Sit Dectus. down, we didn't see if there was an option. For... Oh, for Melina and Ronnie. Yeah, you skipped through it. I didn't even get to see. Oh, there is actually. Yeah, see? 
You skip through shit. Sorry. I will say at everyone to check about me. But then literally ignores it. Spoken echoes of Queen Marika linger here as well. Shall I share Loads them with you? Of... I'm interested. Queen Marika's own words. The Earth Tree governs all. The choice is thine. Become one with the Order. Or divest thyself of it. We kind of have to already divested. at the fringes. A powerless upstart. Okay. Um, no. I do also have a few more spells on which I guess I could try out a little bit. The Sibius Summons, not very useful because it takes ages. Magma Shot, probably useful for fire stuff. We put the new Crystal Release, terrible. We put the... Ah. Oh, you want to put Meteorite on? Yeah! Get through stuff before I finish my fucking thing. You yeah. bastard. Alright. I'm right spell. I'll take I'm off crystal release because that's awful. But yeah, that one. one. Because I think it's going to be a better... Oh, hello, ghost. Hi, block. No, it doesn't. <clears throat> it's there somewhere. Another path leading back to the foot of the Earth Tree. An ancient tunnel. I think that's referring to the ravine. Wall? I think it's referring to this. I mean, I can see if there's an illusionary wall, but I don't think so. Yeah. And also I can take off the... Uh, you know. So, let's go up we the haven't really been in that. We haven't really been in that ravine. No, no, we have. We, we did it. Did we clear it out? Yes, oh, we cleared it out. Reckon. Uh, Drop a thingy in the deep. Good idea. That definitely looks like... Dark Souls. Remember? Was it Dark Souls no. 1? There's a tree where you go before it you know. No. Like, I don't think there's anything down there. And I did try. Right, try again. I don't think there's anything down yeah, that, there. Yeah, that, that, perfect. Worth trying. Not if there's nothing down there. Like, you know, if well, there was going to be something side. down there, I Wait, think there would be an. There that you can... I think there would be an obvious path. Like, this seems like it'd be better, but. No, it's better. Okay. Look up. I was just wondering if that could go round, but it doesn't. Oh yeah, that's just I'm a quick. really sick. Yeah, oh, that's fine. So, let's go ahead and do this. Oh, uh, the thing on the top there. On the top where? But those. I mean, they're statues. I'm just really aware that statues could, you know, kaboom. Come to life. It, oh. Oist medallion. Okay, I guess we could. Oh, of course, because we've got the two yeah, halves. Yeah, we, we've got the two halves. Yeah. So. Alright, well, let's do that then. Uh, really? Okay, we're Why not, not? going to have a look around first. Oh, go all the way around. <clears throat> I'm just worried about a, a mm. world change. I don't think it's a world change, it's a, it's a lift. What's that? Suppose it's worth checking. It's the medallion. No. Like such okay. a jack span. We need the sails. Kind of stuff. Hoist the I medallion. think it's the word hoist, specifically. Special cutscene as well. Kind of like. Good ass. They're gonna do something. Most likely. Okay. I wonder if we'll get another cutscene for when we do the other medallion as well. Yeah, I'm found it. We found one part of it, but not the other part. We didn't really follow the Albanoric. Well, we can't. We, it has to be in the altar's plateau. <laughs> yeah. What is oh, this way? Oh, uh, that's a lot more lift than I thought was going to be lifting up. Well, what did you... I guess. Mm -hmm. The biggest lift in the whole game. Probably. Might not be the... Longest. The longest lift. Oh, no, actually, it's not the biggest lift. Over there, wasn't it? The fucking... Uh, no, I don't think so. 
Yeah. You're talking about the, the one near the Divine Bridge, but I'm yeah. pretty sure that this is the biggest in its sheer volume, if not its length of travel. So, okay. Um, We're in the Altus Plateau. Open it. Uh, yeah. So we're just to the side of where we came up before, because okay. we did this. We haven't done any exploration around here yet. But it seems like there's a tunnel as well. Yeah. Like under the... Yeah. So... Yeah, Altus Plateau. Huh. I actually wasn't expecting there to be a, another side of the back side of this. There's a grace okay. over there. Oh, you mean that? Yeah. Good eye. Get eyes and he's got glasses on. Yeah. Alright, well, let's go ahead and sit. That Altus Plateau, talk to me. Oh, no, it's the. Oh, oh yeah, the spirit flags. The Erd Tree is close, only a little further till the foot of the Erd Tree, and the accord is fulfilled. It takes me back. I was born at the foot of the Erd Tree, where Mother gave me my purpose. Though now, everything is lost to me. I have to ascertain for myself the reason for which I live, burned and bodiless. Ooh. Um. So yeah, so Melina doesn't have a body of her own. It seems like. So that's why she's traveling along with us. And also, um, you said about we're close to the end of the game. No, we're not. Oh, okay. 